Hi, I'm Mike Regan with Transact's Two Minute Warning for the week of November 17th. If you're wondering what's going on at our ports, relax. We've got some vitally important information for you, and we also need to talk about how transportation rate increases are affecting the profitability of your business. <laughs> Over the past couple of months, we've talked about a lot of different things in these two-minute warnings. For example, last week we talked about what was going on at our nation's ports on the West Coast. We've also talked about how transportation rate increases could impact your business. Today what we want to do is to provide you with some more important information on these two very, very critical topics. With respect to the ports, we have seen the situation go from bad to worse. In fact, some people are saying it's getting to be at the crisis level. Now, we really don't have enough time in these two-minute warnings to give you all the information you need, so here's what we've done. We went out and we interviewed Bruce Carlton, who's the head of the National Industrial Transportation League, and is a wealth of information about what is actually going on. So rather than talk about these things in a two-minute warning, we want to direct you to Transact.com and we're going to encourage you to download the interview with Bruce Carlton because it is going to have an impact on supply chains throughout North America if the ports continue to slow down or worse, shut down. It could cost us $2 billion a day. Now, one of the reasons I'm happy and glad to be a member of the Knit League is because through my engagement and involvement with the League, we get access to all this information, and it's the kind of information shippers can use to manage their supply chains. Now, one other thing I want to talk about. Last week, I got a call from a CEO, and he shared with me one of the challenges they're having. One of the things they have to do is bid freight on these projects that they are handling. And when they bid the freight, they go out to their brokers or their carriers and they get an estimated cost for moving the freight from point A to point B. Well, guess what? When they have to actually move the freight when the project's complete three to six months later, what they're finding is no one's honoring their contracted prices, which means the freight costs are coming in a lot higher, they're eating a lot of dollars, and it's having a very big impact on their profitability. And that's why we encourage you to give us a call, because we have a lot of strategies that you can use to mitigate the impact of these unpleasant surprises. And we provide all of this information to you because, as we remind you with each and every two-minute warning, we are on your team, we're here to help, and we are passionate about seeing you be successful. Thanks for your time.